Welcome back to the Fireable Fates Conquest Blind Run. Last time, we stormed the Rainbow Sage's fortress, defeated our older sister from Hoshido in battle, but thankfully didn't kill her or any of her retainers. Unfortunately, the Rainbow Sage died of old age anyway, but at least that let us get around one of Iago's loopholes. Speaking of which, Chapter 12, Bitter Intrigue. I really hope that means we're going to be fighting Iago's forces. Because seriously, somebody needs to punch that guy in the face. A lot. And I love this music. Anyway. Now, I've got a few things I can do here. Let's just talk to some people. Cabbage. How about this heroic ore of Listen justice? Up. Sapphire. Yes. You know, I get the feeling Cam Camilla manning the dairy is intended. Yeah, I think that's intentional. Oh, that's cool. Considering you're a little lower level than the rest of us, and I'm... Don't know when I'll need to use you. Also, that golem there. I'll actually show you what that looks like, because I have actually seen that, and it looks very weird. Uh, wheat. I guess you could use that. Huh. It's not like we have a clean or anything. And that's everything I can do with everyone, so let's go to the lottery shop. What do you want? Try the dusk lottery. Will I get anything better than a consolation prize? I doubt yeah, consolation prize again. <sighs> well, at least I'm getting some resources that I didn't have before. Her voice sounds really familiar, by the way. I don't know exactly who does it, but it sounds familiar. Uh fight in the arena or no, I'll save that for last. Oh, actually, let's try the mess hall. Who's on cooking duty? Oh! Yeah, I've heard that Mozu is really, really good at cooking. So, yeah, definitely want this. Do you want strength, speed, resistance, or... Defense. I'm really glad that, I, that one of my main resources on the, this path that I got is, um, is speed, because that's one of the best stats. Haven't actually seen Blushing Mozu before. <sighs> wow, look at me. <laughs> um, how do you make that sound making milk? <laughs> Delicious yogurt. Yeah, she is one of the best cooks in the army. <laughs> well, you know, she does come from a rural village. She probably has to cook a lot like this. Mm, that's wonderful. Yeah, uh, culinary genius, certainly. Speed plus one, and speed plus one, magic plus one. And for some reason, Mozu herself ate that. Oh, nice speed there, totally not Severa. Uh, I want to get Azura to level 10 quickly so she can learn her skill, because that's really going to help us out. Oh, hey, magic and speed's good for her. Oh, magic and speed's great for Camilla, too. Oh, Kamui, yeah, she'll appreciate that. That cancels out the speed penalty from the Dragonstone, I just realized. And Jacob, that's actually really good. Kinda wish that, um, yeah. Um, that, um, Arthur got that, because his speed has a few issues, but oh well. Let's see if any of them are gonna find the arena. Let's see, who's up for arena duty? Such a tease. Oh, you again. Okay. Ah, uh, fine. Oh, what? Oh, I wanted Camilla. Oh well, you two can go together. What to bet? Let's see. I don't want to waste that crystal. How about a uh, some berries? Uh, yeah, you have better defense. Oh, although you only have a bronze sword equipped. Uh, I'll I'll better on you. Merc versus mer oh, exactly the same as you. Huh, <laughs> interesting. Oh, oh, okay. This looks all right. Oh. Put up a fight. <laughs> Take this. Yeah, this looks pretty good for us. Told you I was tough. <laughs> yes, yes, you certainly did. Nice job, this uh, uh I mean I mean uh Selena, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> of course they won. And now let's check out the prison. Oh, oh, Elise, why do you have to be the prison guard? 
So anyway, we've got someone in here. And it's Yukari? Um, hi Yukari, how'd you come through time and space and turn into a Pegasus Knight? That's like the exact opposite of what you are. So yeah, I think the names are randomly generated. Um, I could persuade her with some Onyx that I have a lot of. But yeah, I would have. I wish that uh, archers could be female, uh, like generic enemy archers, because getting a female archer named Yukari would be awesome. I've heard that one of the random names you can get is Naruto. Seriously, she has no weapons though. Should I try and? I have a feeling at least would be good at persuading. Let's try. Uh, yeah. It, um, let's see if Elise can do this. Okay, let's try talking nicely. Check out my skills. <laughs> you know. <laughs> you know. Oh, thanks. That's actually pretty hilarious. Almost convinced. Okay. So maybe if I do that again next chapter, she'll she'll come. Alternatively, I could just bribe her. You know what? I'll just bribe. I need 13 onyx. Okay then. What's the capacity of our prison at the moment? I'll need to check, because I want to save that for bosses that we can capture. Hmm. Uh, there's a capturable boss on the Norb route that I did get spoiled on that I think is coming quite soon. So I'm wondering if we should release Yukari. Uh, what's our capacity on the prison? Like if I go to buildings... Oh yeah, I can build an Iron Herria shop now. Two points. Oh, Nile statue. Okay, not bad. Uh, this will go in the in the Garden of Statues. Oh, and I can build a fire orb. Definitely gonna build that. Let's see. We need to. Someone with good magic needs to man this. I guess we can put it like here. Oh, we can upgrade too. We can upgrade Lilith's temple, but I'm not sure if I want to do that just yet. I'd rather save my points for upgrading the weapon shops and the staff shops so I can get better weapons later in the game. Could build a hot spring, but you know what, I'm going to save my points. Oh yeah, by the way... Okay, I guess we can select update data and get some stuff. So now, if I go to Street Pass Team and, um, where is it? Check Defenses. I can actually practice fighting my own My Castle Team. And with this, I can actually show what the Golems look like. Uh, yeah, they have rocks, they can't move, but they have very long range. And their animations look incredibly bizarre. Just watch this. Just, ugh. But now look what they do. They shoot stuff out of their face. Then, they throw their face at the enemy. And then they suck themselves in and the face falls down like a manhole cover. It just, what? It, I, I don't understand what they were even going for with that animation. That's just so bizarre. Kamui, I know you're obsessed with faces, but this is ridiculous. Um, uh, I actually want to check out if there's anything in the bulletin board. No cards, okay then. Okay, yeah, so Tomes and Scrolls. You may rely on me. For Jacob, okay. Now all we have to do is support, and we've actually got quite a lot of supports off of the last chapter. So we've got Kamui and Odin A, which I actually surprised me seeing how badly they did. Uh, Jacob and Mozu A, again surprising seeing how badly they did. Effie and Mozu C, even more surprising considering how badly they did. And Elite and Camilla C, which is nice. Uh, Camilla and Niles C, definitely welcomes because I want to marry these two. And Selena and Arthur C, makes sense because they fought together a lot. Uh, so what should I do? Uh, let's go for Effie and Mozu. Well, you like eating and Mozu is a good cook, so you'd do quite well together. 
hungry. Oh. Back at your destroyed village. That's funny, I'd never seen her blushing uh, portrait before, and she's now doing it just all the time. <laughs> Don't mess with Effie when she's hungry. From what I've seen, though, Effie was still pretty obsessed with food in the Japanese version, too. Nom nom nom. Lisa's not like, Cake, you took my cake! Uh, oh, oh yeah, Arthur and Niall's got a support. This is going to be interesting. I had no idea they were a compatible support, but, uh, yeah, Justice and a Thief. That's going to be interesting. Maybe I should just do these supports that I don't really care about first. <laughs> I guess C kind of is, except for speed. He's a man of justice! <laughs> it's not like I care about that or anything. Oh. Is that because they've found out about your legendarily bad luck? Exactly, yeah. Wow! And you want him to help you shop. <laughs> So, she'll help with your luck and you help her with shopping? Selin Arthur Alliance! Uh, that sounds like a shipping name. <laughs> That's actually not a bad support. Oh, anyway. This is gonna be interesting! Yes. Exactly, and you both fight together a long time. Yeah, considering that he's a former thief and a, and a known sadist. <laughs> yeah, I had a feeling they'd be like this. Oh, wow. Niles! <laughs> <laughs> Niles, you always say offensive things. Ugh. <laughs> wow. Wow, Niles. Yeah, he's certainly a character. <laughs> okay, I guess now we can do another Niles conversation. If you know what I mean. <laughs> Because you're younger. Well, this is ironic considering how much of a bad childhood these two have had, from what I think. Huh. <laughs> well, I guess we found out Camilla loves puppies. <laughs> oh, wow. That's an interesting way to start the support, but I've heard that it does get really heartwarming towards the end, so this is what I intend to do. Plus, I mean, the two flirting members of the army, yeah, they're perfect for each other. Anyway, oh yeah, I've got Camilla and Elise as well. This should be interesting. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> uh oh. Yeah, everyone's jealous of Camilla's, um, assets. Huh, okay. I guess Elise is still pretty good just the way she is. Hmm. 
that's interesting. I'd like to see how that plays out later. Again, I still feel like I'd like to get all the siblings up to A's with each other, if at all possible, but I don't know if I'll have the time. Okay, how about some A supports now? I don't think I've heard this song before. Yeah, I like how Mozu is really strong about this. <laughs> Jacob, stop being kind of slightly jerkish. Aww. It's not like I'm a nice person or anything. Why is everyone in this army Sundere? Again, why is everyone in this army a Sundere? Anyway, this should be interesting. A comical theme already. <laughs> yep, it is flair for the theatrical. That is pretty awesome. Okay. <laughs> I was worried about this support at first. I was thinking that she was actually not liking him at all, and I was worried about even S supporting him. But then, at least she thinks he's impressive. <laughs> it's. It's. Oh, I thought he'd say Kamui. <laughs> But at least she was the she was the muse, the inspiration. Shadow glitter. Yeah, I'm sure you think of each other like that. So yeah, interesting. I hope their S is okay. I still really, really like the idea of pairing those two though. And so that's every support done. Maybe I should check my inventory though. Did I get anything in the last chapter that people could use? Oh yeah! I got that in Feeble Staff. Maybe I could get back to Jacob? Wow, that's actually a lot of strength. Oh yeah, I also have a Heart Seal and a Master Seal. Also that Rainbow Tonic. Oh yeah, that's what I need! I need to buy more Vulneraries. Oh yeah, also, uh, Kaze has just joined us. Yeah, I kind of ignored that, but there he is. Yeah, he's level 11 now, so I don't know if he gets auto leveled up to 11, or if he just joins with totally different stats in Conquest than he does in Birthright, but maybe he does get auto leveled to 11, and he comes with a Steel Shuriken and, an, and I bought him an Iron Dagger, just, just, just because. Ah, so Shurikens drop strength and Daggers drop magic, that's useful. But I think at the moment... Oh, of course, I've forgotten this. Let's see... Already face looked you two. Oh, this is gonna be good. Um... <laughs> You're not a Boro, Selena. Okay then. Let's see how Sundera you get about this. <laughs> I guess if you wanted to have me over again, that wouldn't be the worst thing in the world. It's not like I'm Sundere or anything. 
<laughs> that was seriously one of the most Sundere things I've ever heard. So yeah, she is still a gigantic Sundere. <laughs> oh, never change. Oh, wait, wait, why would you change? You're not the same person that we've met before in an earlier playthrough. No, you're definitely not. And that, I think, is basically everything. So, let's head out to the next battle. Palace Makarath. Not M Palace Macbeth, because that would be the name of Iago in the Japanese version. An unexpected battle awaits. That gets me even more intrigued. So, let's go. So just what is this unexpected battle? We'll find out in Chapter 12. Bitter Intrigue. Please let us be fighting Iago. Your Majesty. Meanwhile, in Villain Land... Well, mostly for her own powering up the Yato. Hmm. Yeah, died of old age. You know what? That I just realized this is almost exactly like that that um that subplot in a fish called Wanderer about the the assassin who's told to kill an old lady and she eventually dies of a heart attack. Garen, Garen, stop denying that you're a villain. <laughs> Garen, why are you having a laughing fit? <laughs> I think you've gone insane, Garen. Oh. Even Iago is worried about Garen. Wow. Do it. Oh. Okay then. Do not kill her. Um... Listen well. Hmm... Interesting. Now I'm wondering who really is pulling the strings here, Garen, Iago, or the Great Dragon? Yeah, I get the feeling Garen wants to s do something to strengthen Kamui's dragon form, I'm guessing. Oh. Oh! Of course! Interesting! So you want to sacrifice her to an uncle after making her suffer. Just what is King Garen planning? I mean, we know he's evil, but the real question is, why? Uh, Kamui, being back at the castle is a bad idea. Just saying. Especially with your father going insane and all that. Right. Uh, I guess he does, but... Uh... Why can't we all just run away? You know, maybe just live in the mountains somewhere. Go far away and just have a long, villain-free life ahead of us. Just, at least it's so nice here. It almost just breaks my heart to see, well... Not to give away too many other route spoilers, but just what's happening to her in Hoshidor. All right. Elisa's optimism is definitely a help at a time like this. Oh no. Yeah, you just climbed that mountain, didn't you? That's not good. Huh? Or. Or. Elise! Or something's happening to you. Uh oh. I really hope she's not unavailable for this next chapter, because she and Arthur have not had their air support yet, and they were supposed to be my first. Oh, she is really sick. Azura. Truly. Endemic to the, to the islands? Oh, I guess Notre Sagas, yeah. So this is why you always get vaccinated before you travel to somewhere like that, like I did when I went, o when I went on an overseas trip earlier. Didn't get sick at all. Except 
uh, they probably don't have vaccinations in Nor. And even if they did, I dare, I think they'd only be reserved for Garen. Oh no. So we need to send someone to Hoshido quickly. Uh, Kaze, you wouldn't happen to have one of those on you, would you? Uh oh. No. Hey, listen up. This is a message from Lord Iago. What was that? Please tell me it's not kill Elise. Yes. Why do I get the feeling that's not going to be very much rest and relaxation? Uh -huh. The very least, at least needs rest. Oh, he has already. Once more. Yeah. This must be painful for Silas if you're shipping him with Elise. Oh. You have my word. Unless they're like, hmm, make him we suffer. Destroy all the Hoshiden herbs in Makarv. <sighs> oh. I see. And then alternatively, Yago's gonna order you kill the doctors in Makarv. Understood. Oh, we gotta get there quickly. Oh, I recognize this map from trailers and pre release material. <sighs> what? I've been waiting for this. Oh, uh, hi there, Ryoma. Um, so you see, um, uh -huh, uh -huh, um, well, we have a bit of a situation here, and, um, I know we betrayed you earlier, but could you please just put that aside for the moment and, uh, Maybe give us some horses and herbs. Big brother. <sighs> wow. It can't be. <sighs> I'm so sorry. Huh. Oh. <sighs> Kamui, this is for Elise. Please, please think of her A support with Arthur that's so close to being an S. Big brother! No, we're not an enemy of Hoshido. We don't want to fight you. Yeah. Well, she knows how evil the father is, but... The others aren't. Xander and the others... Now face my wrath! Uh-oh. I won't allow it! What? Time for some killing! Huh? Oh, I think I know who we're gonna join now. But sadly, it's not Xander himself. Wow, you're certainly holding your own. <sighs> it's over now. Well, you definitely have the same voice you used to. Wait a minute, why am I saying used to? No. <laughs> huh? I'm Laszlo. I am not an ego. No. But people still killed my father, and they must still prepare to die. But I'm definitely not an ego. No. And I definitely don't like dancing. At all. No. Not at all. Don't worry, I won't reveal your identity to the evil force that you still haven't defeated yet back in your universe. Hi, I'm Perry. And then this is Perry, so yeah. I've... Pulverize, Eviscerate, Ruin, Impale, Perry. So I've heard about her, and I've heard a lot of people saying that I probably wouldn't like her because I really absolutely loathe Henry with a burning passion. At least the localized version of Henry in Awakening. Let me just say that about Perry, I'm not as angry about this because Perry was obsessed with blood and murder in the Japanese version as well. So it's not like they changed her very much. Henry wasn't, so the fact they turned him into a psychopath really annoyed me. That and, I heard that Perry 
gets a lot more sympathetic in her support with Laszlo, which I definitely intend to do in this playthrough. And I heard that, unlike with Henry, they did not totally bastardize her Freudian excuse. That makes sense. Or, other people taught them well. Perhaps, Laszlo's father and mother from another world. No, don't send your retainers on us! No, I don't want to fight the ninjas! They're amazing! Uh-oh. We're fighting Ryoma already? Never expected that. Yeah. He's about to fight. Come on, smile for me. And once again, why I, why I really, really like um, Henry being this guy's father. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. No, Henry can't be this guy's father because that's a totally different character. I'm so sorry. Yeah, we need to get her medical <laughs> attention. Yeah. But we've got to go through Ryoma first. <laughs> oh, you haven't seen the half of it. Wait till you meet the retainers of your Hoshijin siblings. Especially, uh, Hinoka's, yeah, which you already have, but anyway. I had a feeling that, um, that Laszlo and Perry would join. Thank you. Okay. Okay. 